did you not tell me either she's fired or I'm not filming with her? Get her out of here. By the way, I was That's horrified why. by you, but let's be honest. The lovely Heather Dubrow, aka former Real Housewives of Orange County star, no doubt lives in a beautiful OC mega mansion. Her husband, Terry, had said about the 22,000 square foot home, I can hype this house as much as I want. It's gonna live up to that hype. It's going to exceed that hype. And that it does. Heather's customized home took years to complete and it's dubbed Dubrow Chateau, which we're gonna take a look at. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses, and even though I've done a house tour of my own place, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. Heather Dubrow is an actress and TV personality who's best known for starring on The Real Housewives of Orange County from 2012 up until 2016. Her husband, Terry, is also a TV personality, being a famed plastic surgeon, master of his trade, and star on the reality show Botched. The well known and successful couple have an estimated net worth of about $50 million and with that, they constructed their very own dream home in Orange County, California. With a name like the Dubrow Chateau, this mansion has all the over-the-top features you'd expect and then some. The property boasts dramatic views of the ocean and has bonuses like a champagne button in the master suite closet. You won't believe the amenities until you see them, so stay tuned. Is that Terry? Does it have to be Terry? Does the guy always have to be the head of, you know what, I'm the head of the household. While Terry found the plot of land, Heather is the one who's mostly responsible for the design of the home. And if this glam mansion wasn't enough, Heather recently announced that the couple is also building another dream home in Idaho, of all places, a lake house to be exact. Welcome back everyone, I'm Kara the Vampire Slayer and I'm bringing you another exclusive house tour here on Famous Entertainment, taking a look at the homes of Heather Dubrow. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe and ring that bell for notifications because we post brand new content daily. As always, you can follow me over on Instagram to chat and now let's get into this video. one common theme in this house tour, it's that Heather Dubrow knows how to acquire some of the finest homes in Orange County. Back in 2012, during her time on Real Housewives, Heather quietly unloaded this ocean view retreat in Newport Post for a whopping $16.45 million. If you think that was a hefty price, the home was listed again in 2015 for a jaw-dropping 26 mil. The estate was located in Pelican Crest and featured 14,372 square feet set at more than three quarters of an acre. And and boasted seven bedrooms and 10 bathrooms. The deluxe home included a spacious master retreat, perfect for the Dubros to kick back, as well as a kid's wing, and three additional bedroom suites joined by a rumpus room. What is a rumpus room though? Heather also had a home theater here, which had classic leather furnishings and a large projector screen and other entertainment options, if that wasn't good enough. The games room had a wet bar too, and elsewhere, a home gym with all the fixings. Palm trees shaded the front of the property, creating a palace style vibe and walking in this entryway is epic. No, really, I don't know that I've seen a bigger foyer in a family home. It's bigger than a ballroom and has a double sided staircase, chandelier and sky high ceilings. Because a ballroom style entryway isn't enough, there's yet another ballroom sized room with dark hardwood floors, fireplace and full glass sliders outside. Other features of the former Dubro mansion included a posh wood paneled study with fireplace and TV, extra large master bath with yet another sleek fireplace and a sprawling walk-in closet to go with it. There was a finished basement level at this mansion by the looks of it too, with a full bar, a living room, a wine cellar, and much more. Elsewhere, there was some sort of dance studio, an outdoor courtyard that looks to be for sports, and then a huge pool. The swimming pool was the feature of Heather's backyard and came with a built-in spa and a modern design. The grounds had plenty of perfect looking grassy lawns surrounding the pool, gardens, as well as terraces to dine and sunbathe. While this mega home would make you the talk of the town, the Dubros wanted something even more impressive, something that they designed themselves. If you thought that last residence was over the top, you're in for a treat with Heather's second and current Orange County home. For starters, this sprawling mansion is located in the exclusive enclave of Crystal Cove and features a whopping 22,000 square feet set on a 40,000 square foot property that comes with dramatic ocean views. As I mentioned, her husband Terry found the lot they built the home on, but Heather did most of the designing. So let's 
check out the breathtaking Chateau du Bro. The exterior was inspired by the Breakers Palm Beach in Florida and comes with a stunning front exterior and driveway lined with matching water features. Once you see the wild features that were created in the mansion, you're in for a surprise. There are things like custom champagne buttons and even stuff for the couple's children to enjoy like an arcade style hallway. But I'll break all of these down shortly. Heather and Terry's palace boasts a grand entrance with marble floors, glass furnishings and gray walls with soaring ceilings. Then you'll find many lounging spaces with fireplaces and plenty of floor to ceiling glass doors and retractable windows to move in and out of the home easily. The kitchen has black beams running across the ceiling and it's designed in a sleek modern aesthetic. The kitchen is open concept alongside the family room and is sprawling to say the least. While there are add-ons here like two marble islands, one with a built-in fridge with champagne and over in the dining room there's another champagne wall. It's safe to say Heather likes her champagne because she has a similar feature in her master suite. The couple's master bedroom comes with a private sitting area, a balcony and huge walk-in closet and one of the unique bonuses, a champagne button that rings a bell in the kitchen and brings the bubbly right to you via a rolling library ladder. Terry has commented on how large their master suite is but that the room is also weirdly intimate. Over in the attached bath there's all the usual fixings as well as a number of beauty salon features like his and her seating areas, a shampoo sink and two makeup stations. Now when you see the downstairs basement bar you'll understand why this home costs north of 21 million dollars. Chateau du Bro's basement comes with a massive subterranean bar that rivals a five star hotel. It features sofas, leather chairs and unique highlights like a glowing bar, two beer taps and four television screens. Furthermore the space opens directly to an interior courtyard with a stunning lit tree. In addition to the sheer size of Heather's home it's remarkable for all these customized features sprinkled throughout. Other bonuses include towel warming drawers and a special entertainment area downstairs. The couple has four children and they made sure that the home wasn't only full of stuff for the adult. The lower level of the mansion is a teen's dream with an entire hall of pinball game, 21 seat movie theater and pocket doors that allow you to create one giant space. As you'd expect the Dubro Chateau also comes with a five star resort backyard. The yard includes a number of luxurious sitting areas complete with circular beds, alfresco dining tables, fire features and heaters soaring above for those chillier nights. The amenities back here are centered around a gorgeous pool that can change color by night and a jacuzzi. Then the awe inspiring barbecue pavilion comes with a pizza oven, additional wet bar and big TV perfect to gather around and watch a game or concert with friends. Elsewhere there's an additional bathroom with his or hers changing areas and pool bath just to make sure everyone at the pool party is comfortable. Since it wouldn't be fit for Heather otherwise she made sure to include a number of unique details outdoors including a gong, human sized bird cages and olive trees. And I can see why Heather loves to show off Chateau du Bro. In case you didn't already know, this estate required a ton of planning and money. Before I wrap this up, let's see some of the most expensive things at the Dubro Chateau. You may recall the champagne art wall discussed earlier. Well, considering it's made up of 300 bottles of Veuve Clicquot, it costs approximately 12K to stock. And how can we forget the movie theater with massive screen and about two dozen seats with their own phone charging station? This room cost the Dubros a whopping $1 million to construct. Finally, you wouldn't believe how many cabinets there are in a mansion this big. As it turns out, Heather revealed that she forked out $630,000 in the home's cabinetry alone. Imagine home cabinets costing almost as much as a regular house. All right, so I think I'll bring this house tour to an end here. We got to take a look at Heather Dubrow's crazy, impressive properties in Orange County, including her former Newport Coast castle and she and her husband's ultra custom current mansion in Orange County, aka Chateau Dubrow. Now the tricky question, what what was your favorite feature or room in Chateau du Bro? Honestly, with all those unique and custom add-ons, it's hard to remember all of them. I'm not as big of a champagne fan as Heather, but she's pretty clever to make it so accessible throughout the home. I gotta say, I love the million dollar movie theater and the beautiful pool. If you could choose one of the custom amenities, which would it be? Be sure to let me know what you liked best about Heather's mansions down in the comments. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and I will see you all next time. Bye.